गुड आफ्टरनून स्टूडेंट्स Yes. In the last class, we have calculated how much the moment of inertia should be of a flywheel, so that we can make it load equalization. We have calculated the equation of moment of inertia. of a flywheel to make a load equalization that's right it is yes. what we have done in the previous class mm, two equation sir two, two equation of moment of inertia of a flywheel yes sir to make load equalization based on that based on that or say based on these two formula today we starting we start with a numerical problem and the numerical problem is as like a motor equipped with a flywheel is to supply a load torque of 1000 newton meter for 10 second followed by a light load period of 200 newton meter long enough for the flywheel to resume its steady state it is desired to limit the motor torque to 700 newton meter what should be the moment of inertia of the flywheel it has to be calculated the motor has an inertia of 10 kg meter square and its no load speed is 500 rpm and the slip at the torque of 500 newton meter is 5% and assume the speed torque characteristics of motor to be straight line in the region of intersect so we have to calculate the moment of inertia of the flywheel here the flywheel should be of supply load torque of 1000 newton meter for 10 second and the low light period is 200 newton meter and the desired limit of motor torque is 700 the motor inertia is 10 kg meter square and no load speed 500 rpm and in 500 newton meter torque the slip is 5% so in this problem first determine the no load speed from the rpm to radian per second first determine it it is yeah. which quantity we have here load torque mm -hmm. first consider actually what is the formula yes yeah. what is the formula j is equal to T R by omega m zero minus omega m r into T H by log of log of t 
एल एच माइनस टी मीन वाई टी एल एच माइनस टी मैक्स दिस इज द फॉर्मूला यस सर टू डिटरमाइन द मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया एंड here the quantity given our suppose which quantity we will require which quantity see there which quantity we have to require first tlh this is tlh also TLH, T max, T min, and TH, TR, omega m zero, omega m r. So, tell me what is the value of TLH? It is. What is the value of TLH? Ten second. TLH. Not ten second. This is ten second is value of TH. What is the value of TLH? How much torque is to be supplied? See that. See in that problem. Torque. How much load torque to be supplied? What is the highest value? Thousand nanometer. Thousand nanometer. Yes. Newton meter. So load. Thousand Newton meter. Oh, sorry, Newton meter. Yes. That means this is the value of load torque. Load torque T L H. What is the value? What is this? T H T S T S What is this? Light load period. So that quantity is represented by which term? It is. Yes, sir. Which term we represent by the light load period? By which term we represent the light load period? Okay. How much the value of the torque at that time? Two hundred newton meter. Two hundred, but represented by TLL. Oh, uh, yes, sir. T L H T L. And then finally, we going to steady state. Determine the limit uh, desired torque limit. And it is desired to limit the torque of the motor. Uh, Seven hundred newton meter. What is this quantity? What is that quantity? It is desired to limit the motor torque to seven hundred newton meter. The motor torque, or say maximum motor torque, is seven hundred newton meter. Because T max, T max. Because here it is that 
it is desired to limit the motor torque to 700 that means you have to restrict the motor torque within 700 newton meter that means this is t max yes sir t this is t max and this is basically motor moment of inertia that means j m and the speed no load speed what is the value of no load speed 500 rp what is the value of the no load speed 500 rp so no load. Hmm. yes and it is represented by omega m0 it is represented by omega m0 and the slip at the torque of 500 newton meter is 5 percent that means we have to determine omega m r and what is the value of tr at that time is 500 so first write which quantity are given TLAH is equal to 100, not 100, 1000 Newton meter. TH is 10 second. Then TLL, TLLH 200 Newton meter. Then T max, T max is how much? Yes, sir, seven hundred. Value of T max? Seven hundred. Seven hundred. And J M. J M equal to 10 kg meter square omega m0 is 500 rpm then trh the value of trh 500 newton meter newton meter and first convert the omega m0 from rpm to radian per second this is our first step so to convert from rpm to radian per second what we should do this what we should do so Pi by one at the now. We have 500 RPM. We have to convert it in rad per second. Ek bar agar ghum raha hai. Koi agar kuch. Ek bar ghum raha hai to kitna radian ghum ta hai? Suppose one. One at Suppose one. Uh, Revolution. Suppose one uh, say sept. Suppose a sept is rotated in one RPM. Then how much angle it covered? Ek sept agar ek bar ghuma pura. So, kitna rotation hua angle mein? Three sixty. 360 मतलब 2 पाई 
the value is 2 pi mm, 2 pi तो इसका यूनिट क्या होगा इसका यूनिट रेडियन पर से सर रेडियन रेडियन पर सेकंड पर सेकंड और पर मिनट ओ सॉरी पर मिनट रेड पर मिन बट वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट इट इन रेड पर सेकंड व्हाट वी हैव टू डू What do you have to do? In, into 60? Into 60 or divided by 60? Yeah, divided by 60. <coughs> Man, leje, ek minute me jada ghume ga ki second me jada ghume ga? Second me jada, eh, minute me jada ghume ga. Man, lagar usse hum second me convert karenge to divide karna padega. क्योंकि वो क्वांटिटी छोटा होगा छोटा होगा ना वो सो कोई अगर मान लीजिए हम बोल रहे हैं कि सेकंड में घूम रहा है मतलब वो जो मान लीजिए एक सेफ्ट एक सेकंड में एक बार घूमता है तो एक मिनट में कितना घूमेगा 60 60 मतलब अगर कोई रिप्रेजेंट है पर मिनट में मतलब पांच मिनट में अगर 60 घूमेगा तो एक सेकंड में एक बार घूमेगा तो मतलब उसे 60 से डिवाइड करना है सो व्हाट इज द वैल्यू व्हाट इज द वैल्यू वी कैन कैलकुलेट इट एंड टेल मी व्हाट इज द वैल्यू 500 into 2 pi by 60 कैलकुलेट इट एंड टेल मी द वैल्यू Fifty five by three. Pura solve numerically solve karna Fifty as a fifty three thousand. Three thousand. What is the value of pi? One eighty. One eighty. No, we are not calculating in degree, we are calculating in radian. If we uh, write the unit degree per second then you can write it 180 but the value of pi is 3 point 3 point 1 okay, okay. 3 point 3 what is the, what is the value of pi 3 point 1 4 1 4 52 point something कितना है 52.33 52 point 33 red per second अब omega m r का value कितना है What is the value of omega m r? वो तो calculate करना है हाँ कितना slip बोला 5% देखिए यहाँ पर है 5% 5% slip
मान लीजिए अगर आपके पास नो लोड स्पीड है मतलब वो सिंगल स्पीड है यस नॉर्मली नॉर्मली वी आर कंसीडरिंग द नो लोड स्पीड इज सिंगल स्पीड एंड यस अ गिवन स्लिप इज 5% नाउ टेल मी व्हाट इज द एक्चुअल स्पीड ऑफ दैट मोटर एट दैट टाइम व्हाट इज द स्पीड एट दैट टाइम when the slip is 5% what is the formula actually tell me the first formula. ns minus nr by ns here we should write so, omega because we are calculating in terms of omega actually what is the formula of slip S is equal to N S minus N R by N R. N S. N R. N I by N R or N S. Machine two me pade ho bolo. Ye kya hoga N R ya N S? Ye kya hoga? एनआर और एन एस राइट एस माइनस वन इक्वल टू माइनस एन आर बाय एन एस डेट वन माइनस एस इक्वल टू एन आर बाय एन एस सो फ्रॉम डेट वी कैन गेट एन आर इक्वल टू एन एस इनटू वन माइनस एस एंड इफ वी राइट ओमेगा आर इक्वल टू ओमेगा एस फॉर्मुलाइनसूमेगा Five hundred RPM and fifty-two point three three radian. Fifty-two point three three. Ah yes, radian per. And what is the value of S? How much sleep is there? Sleep. And what is the value of sleep? Five percent. Five percent. That means five percent. Five by hundred. So calculate it and tell me what is the value. Zero point zero five. Fifty point three three into ninety five by hundred. So what is the value? इसके बाद 
उसके बाद क्या है उसके बाद तो वन है सर वन वन रेड पास सेकेंड फॉर्मूला जे इज इक्वल टू टी आर बाय ओमेगा एम जीरो माइनस ओमेगा एम आर इनटू टी एच बाय लॉग टी एल एच माइनस जीरो 500 रेडियन पर लाइट लोड पीरियड टॉक इज द मिनिमम टॉक If there is no given the minimum torque of the motor, so you have to consider the light load period torque is the minimum torque. And tell me what is the light load period torque? What is the value of the light load period torque? Two hundred newton meter. That means you have to consider the T mean is two hundred. So this should be two hundred. Now calculate it and tell me the value. First, calculate this one. How much is the value? Five hundred. By fifty-two point three three minus forty-nine point seven one. What is the value of that? Let's calculate the value of 500 divided by 52.33 minus 49.71. And tell me what is the value of this portion. Then we go to the logarithmic portion. 
then we calculate the work. Yes, what is the value? 500 divided by 52.33 minus 49.71. Let's calculate that part. Yes, sir. Oh. Let's Double for it. That sir. part. 500 divided by 52.33 minus 49.71. Then we go in logarithmic portion, then calculate the one. Calculate me the direct hazards. Part by part, for me to each other galatua to Pura Galat. Part by part, calculator allowed. Calculator allowed. Nato ye problem may solve. Missing the exam may have to calculate a lonely. So, what an MCQ? What a missing one? Sir, I'm not direct fourth semester. May I do this? Only a fourth semester. Sir, fourth semester. Fourth semester. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Online is all right. So, first calculate this part okay. 500 divided by 52.33 minus 49.7. First calculate this part, and you have to calculate in small portion, otherwise, it may complex and maybe result is wrong. Your result may be wrong. 190, 90.83. 400. 190.83. Total value. Yes, sir. First calculate this portion. What is the value of that portion? First calculate that portion. What is the value? Yes, sir. First tell me the value of that portion. How much? 190. 190.83. Okay. Then write it 10. Then calculate this logarithm part. First, this can be calculated in mind. How much? This is 800. 1000 minus 200, that means 800. And the denominator part is 300. That means you have to calculate the value of log of 8 by 3. What is the value of log 23. of 8 by 3? How much? 23.47. 23.47. Now calculate the value. Five fifty point nine seven. Overall twenty three point four seven. Overall मतलब ten से divide करने के बाद की. Yes sir yes sir. Okay. Ten divided by log eight by three.
कैलकुलेटर में तो लॉग एट बाई थ्री की है बेस ई है लॉक लिया कि लॉक मैंने एलएन लिया कौन सा लिया लॉक लॉक लिए एलएन लॉक लिए सर लॉक का तो बेस होता है कितना लॉक का बेस कितना होता है नॉर्मल कैलकुलेटर में रहता है और एलएन का बेस कितना होता है का बेस कितना होता है जो एलेन है उसका बेस है ई और जो लॉग है उसका बेस है टेन यहां पर हमें क्या लेना है
ये कैलकुलेट करो कितना होता है एल एन एट बाई थ्री एल एन मतलब लॉक बेस ई और सिर्फ हम लॉक लिखेंगे तो उसका बेस होगा टेन पॉइंट नाइन एट पॉइंट नाइन अब अगर इसे टेन से डिवाइड करोगे तो कितना आएगा एलएन मतलब लॉग बेस ई लॉग जो होता है उसका होता है लॉग बेस टेन ठीक है इट इज यस सर जब भी लॉग ई बेस होगा तो तब तुम्हें कैलकुलेटर में बैठना तो एलएन को देना है अगर बेस टेन होगा तो जो नॉर्मल लॉग है उसे लेना टोटल वैल्यू कितना है ये वो एलएन फिर एक बार करो एक बार करके देखो वैल्यू ठीक एलएन ब्रैकेट देना पे मिस्टेक हो रहा है बैकेट दिया ना तुम बैकेट तो दिया बैकेट नहीं दिया एलएन एलएन ब्रैकेट एट बाई थ्री कितना है? एलएन एट बाई थ्री सर पॉइंट नाइन एट पॉइंट नाइन नाइन ही आ रहा है ठीक है फिर ये कैलकुलेट कर लें कितना आ रहा है 
सर एल एन डेटेड ने एट बाई थ्री पॉइंट जीरो पॉइंट नाइन एट ही तो गूगल में भी वही आ रहा है पूरा मल्टीप्लाई करने के लिए डिवाइडेड बाय पॉइंट नाइन एट हाँ इसका पूरा सो फुल सॉल्यूशन ना इसका मतलब कंप्लीट आंसर कंप्लीट आ रहा सर फोर हंड्रेड फोर थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड सेवेंटी नाइन डबल फोर सेवेन नाइन सेवेन नाइन पॉइंट नाइन जीरो पॉइंट नाइन जीरो हाँ यस सर यही आ रहा ये क्या चाह रहा है इनको अगर 0.9 से डिवाइड करोगे कितना नो सर 1946.46 आ रहा है ये देखो ना क्या हो रहा है टेंस अगर ये भी 1 की तरह ही है ना ओपरी ओपरी भी आता है हां ये भी हो ये भी तो 1 की ओपरी करने का अगर और फिर वो लॉग भी एक बार चेक कर लेना ठीक है यस yes. मैं थोड़ा सा चेंज लग रहा है मुझे ठीक है तो ये है टोटल मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया ऑफ द फ्लाईवेल सिस्टम सो टेल मी द व्हाट इज द एक्चुअल मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया ओनली द फ्लाईवेल सर दिस इज बेसिकली द टोटल मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया सो यू शुड When we calculate the, only the moment of inertia of flywheel, so we have to subtract the moment of inertia of the motor. Okay. So here should be the value. वन नाइन से टी सेवन वन नाइन टी सेवन के जी मीटर्स ओके नाउ मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक डीसी मोटर ड्राइव और नेक्स्ट मॉडल इज डीसी मोटर ड्राइव एक्चुअली टेल मी वेयर वी एक्चुअली यूज द डीसी मोटर Very prefer. Which kind of application we prefer this one? The 
सर कांस्टेंट स्पीड इलेक्ट्रिक ट्रैक्शन और कांस्टेंट पे जो व्हिच काइंड ऑफ मोटर वी यूज सॉल्ट सॉल्ट टाइप एंड फॉर ट्रैक्शन टाइप सीरीज सीरीज गुड एंड लिफ्ट लिफ्ट सर आल्सो लिफ्ट आल्सो एक्चुअली ट्रैक्शन और आल्सो ये लिफ्ट फर्स्ट लिफ्ट दीज आर द कैटेगरी ऑफ ट्रैक्शन No sir. Also, DC motor used in lift, sir. I am saying that the traction is also a lift. And the hoist, we are saying hoist. Hoist, yes, sir. Hoist. This is also a kind of lift. What kind of motor is this? Sand motor. This is sand motor. This is sand motor. The car. Three. Yes, sir. लास्ट वन इज सोटर फर्स्ट वन इज सो नाउ टेल मी व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ द फर्स्ट वन How many sources are connected there? How many sources? In the first diagram, you see two two sources. Two. Uh, that means the same source is used in the first figure, or that there are two different sources are used. two different two sources and we uh, excited the field from a separate source Se separate separately excited field. that means this is a separately excited type this is separately excited type and this is sun type
what is the name of that friend model? This one, the third one. What is the name of that type? Series, this is series motor. Series type. What is the name of that kind? Compound motor. Compound. And there are two types of compound motor based on the field of the uh, based on the position of the field coil. Yes, long sun, short sun. And which one is long sun and which one is short? First one is short sun, last one is long sun. This is good. This is short sun. This is long sun. Good. And tell me what is the equation and actually the characteristics of sun motor and separately excited motor are quite same and you can say this is an equivalent type the separately excited type and sun type so first tell me what is the equation of back in so tell me first the equation of back in Is the equation of back in with the value of EB. D minus IARS. D minus IARS. D minus IARS. D is equal to D minus And what is the expression? Say we also write uh, EB is equal to P phi like that. What is the value? P phi and J by 68. We also write by this. So from that equation, we can say. EB is equal to a constant phi into say n. You can also say uh, omega. Also, like also write like that. It is sir. EB is equal to p phi in z by 16. This is also a mm, yes. of back EMF. This is also mm. equation of G100 EMF. In case of back EMF, we also write the same expression like the G100 EMF. P phi NJ by 68. Yes. So if a machine is designed, already the machine is designed, then we can write the number of pole is constant. So number of total of conductor is a constant and the number of parallel path between two brushes is also constant. So we can write E B is equal to K phi into N Yes sir. Okay. okay. Pole constant and uh, actually uh, a constant. we have convert n into omega. So because the unit of n is RPM and the unit of omega is rad per second.
and what is the equation of torque T is equal to constant then tell me what is the torque equation for DC motor It is. Tell me, what is the torque equation? Torque equation kya tha? A constant tha, uske baad? तो संघ के लिए क्या होगा सीरीज के क्या लोग होगा वो तो बाद में सब डिसाइड करेंगे पहले जनरल इक्वेशन दो फर्स्ट वी कंसीडर द जनरल इक्वेशन ऑफ डीसी मींस मोटर सो वी कैन राइट ई बी इज इक्वल टू के पाई ओमेगा एम दिस इज इक्वेशन 1 सपोज दिस इज इक्वेशन 1 एंड व्हाट इज द टॉर्क इक्वेशन फॉर डीसी मोटर कुछ नहीं था torque is proportional to flux and armature current proportional to and when we equate it then we can write t is equal to k phi into ia and what is the speed equation what is the speed equation first tell me in terms of n then we convert it in, in terms of omega yahan se bolo kya hoga it is it is yes sir isse bolo kya hoga what is the value of m ev by k phi ev by k EV by K phi. And what is the value of EV from the previous equation? We have said the first equation. What is the first equation? This is the first equation of EV. So put the value of EV from that equation. What is the value of EV? V minus. V minus I R. V minus I R. By K phi. Suppose we are considering omega here, then we write P by minus I A R A by K E phi. So omega is equal to P by K E phi minus. R A by K E into phi times. So if we replace the value of I A by from that equation, suppose this is also a, we also write this would be E. So replace the value of I A from that equation. What is the value of I A from here? Calculate it first. T by K E into phi. Okay. 
this. Yes, sir. From that equation, first calculate the value of IA from the top equation. E by E by K K e by K to five. Put that value on that equation. So we can write D e by K into five. Minus R A by K E into I square into T. Am I saying it correctly, na? Yes. Very very good. Yes, sir. Yeah, in the in the code, okay. So you have to remember this one equation one, and this is equation two, and this is equation three. You have to remember these three equations. Hand motor, we are considering the flux is constant. For hand motor, we consider that the flux is constant. Why? The question is why? Why we consider the flux is constant for hand motor? Tell me, anyone? Why? This above maybe this above it is because so it is connected parallelly. It is connected parallelly. And the supply voltage, if we make a constant supply voltage, let's say if we if our supply system is constant, then we can say the flux is constant. Yes. Sir. And for normal operation, for normal operation, we make the supply is constant because there are only there is no direct device which can vary the DC type sources. Suppose we have to change the voltage level. Suppose we have to change the voltage level. If the system is AC, which machine is used to convert the voltage level? Or say which device is used? To change the voltage level in case of AC. Oh, voltage level. Yes. Transformer. Transformer. Good. But in case of DC, if the system is DC, and we have to change the voltage level, which device? Chopper. Why? Which device is to be used? Chopper. Chopper. Good. But suppose. The time, or the, suppose that ER is 1950. Suppose this is the year 1950. Then, मान लीजिए ये साल अभी ये 1950 है. तब क्या होगा? Then, can you use chopper? No. Why? 
that time uh, it is not introduced that means on that time the power electronic devices are not introduced yeah yes sir. so normally what we do we don't vary the dc type voltage normally so we make constant supply to dc type motor so if the supply is constant though the armature and field are in parallel in case of front motor so we can say the flux should be constant in case of sun, sun motor okay it is yes sir okay. and tell me what about series motor sir uh, there is a um, sir where flux is not constant because it is connected in series though the uh, field coil is connected in series so the flux is not constant yes sir and the flux is proportional to the which quantity flux is which quantity flux is proportional to the flux is proportional to the current sir field current and in case field of, current in case of series motor the field current and armature current are equal or not same 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 sir that means equal yes sir so in case of series motor we can say the flux is depend on armature current that means how much load is connected to the motor that current determine the value of flux okay so that's all for today deepak have you any question priti have you any question regarding this no sir no sir ritesh have you any question yes sir sir hum log yahan pe स्पीड को कंट्रोल करने मतलब मेन मोटर क्या है सर अभी जो हम लोग किए इसका अभी तो मोटर कितना टाइप होता है देखा है दिखाया ना अभी कितना मोटर ये सब ये सब ये पहले लेकिन इसमें इस हां इसमें करना क्या है अभी क्या करना है मतलब मतलब हम क्या पढ़ेंगे या हां मतलब इसमें हम लोग क्या पढ़ेंगे इसमें हम पढ़ेंगे क्या ये जो परफॉर्मेंस एक्चुअली क्या है ये हम ऐसे कैसे कंसल कंट्रोल करते हैं स्पीड कंट्रोल कैसे करता है मान लीजिए एक ट्रैक्शन है उसमें क्या क्या कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स होना चाहिए ठीक है इसका स्टार्टिंग पढ़ेंगे ब्रेकिंग पढ़ेंगे और कितना एक मान लीजिए एक स्टार्टिंग हो रहा है स्टार्टिंग मतलब ये जो डायनामिक कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स है मतलब चेंजिंग वाला अब जब कोई स्टार्टिंग हो रहा है मोटर तब क्या होगा बहुत कुछ पैरामीटर चेंज होगा यस सर उस डायनामिक सिचुएशन में कितना एनर्जी लॉस हो रहा है ये सब बहुत कुछ पढ़ेंगे यहां पर ओके सर स्टार्टिंग ब्रेकिंग रनिंग एंड द डायनामिक्स आल्सो दैट मींस द चेंजिंग पोजीशन ओके 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 सर ओके You have understood all these things. Okay, you may leave now.